Yo, yo, what's going on, everybody? So I wanted to uh, jump on here to ask you guys if you guys are feeling any kind of changes in your diet. And just to kind of relate on this topic, let me give you guys a little story. I used to be a trainer once upon a time. And, you know, a big thing about training and fitness is nutrition. So back uh, about nine, maybe 10 years ago, I got into intermittent fasting. Um, it was a, a big thing for me. So I would, what intermittent fasting is, is basically you're going to fast anywhere from 16 to 23 hours. Usually it's 16 to 20 hours. Okay. So you're not going to eat. And then what you're going to do after that fast is you're going to eat from anywhere according to where you're fasting four to eight hours. Okay. So that's your eating window. So I used to be into that, right? Now, fast forwarding these last couple of years, I've kind of shifted from fasting to I want to eat only about two meals a day. And I would usually eat these meals later in the day. Well, now these last couple months, I haven't, I've been only one meal. I've been like, for whatever reason, look, I don't feel like I need to eat two meals a day. It's more time just sitting down and eating. It's more, first of all, if you don't know, the more you eat, the more your body, the more times you eat during the day, the more your body processes food during the day, thus the more and quicker you age. Fun fact for the day, that's scientifically proven. So I was like, you know, knowing that and knowing other things, I'm like, man, I only wanna eat one time a day, have it be the end of the day, just because one, my fasting now, I've been fasting for so long, it's easy for easier for me to get through the day without eating uh, because it, it can be pretty tiring, especially when you're cleaning carpet. And then two, it's just more, uh, like I said, kind of convenient for me and I can just be focused on what I need to be focused on and then later in the day I get to enjoy a nice big meal. So I've gotten to the point not only where I want to eat one meal, particularly this meal is at nightfall, but now I got to go all the way back to plant-based. I got to go all the way back. Not to say that I wasn't pretty much plant-based currently now, but you know, Thanksgiving comes along. Sure, I'm gonna have a little bit of that honey baked ham, okay? I'm gonna try a bite of that mac and cheese just because it's on the table and I'm still living, you know, with others that are in this societal energy. I, I don't deny it, you know, I still come from that. So the, the worst thing you wanna do is deny who you, who you are right now, because who you are right now, you can use that to become who you truly should be, um, who you are inside. So just always keep that in mind. So now, since I've accepted the path, I'm able to exhaust those avenues. And instead of, you know, me slipping cheese into some meals here and there, or instead of me, you know, okay, you know what, I'm just gonna order this pizza, even though it has a little bit of pepperoni on it, you know, instead of me doing that and being like, ah, uh, now, spiritually, universe willing, my path has led me to, today I woke up feeling some type of way, it's time to lock in, and it's time to go totally plant-based. 2018, 2019, I went plant-based for about 14 months, best decision of my life, inward, outward, and for the whole uh, world, right? But, uh, you know, again, I was still around my environment that I, I don't put anybody, I don't blame anybody. That's another thing. We're going to do a little short lesson. If you're still blaming other people for any of the things that you got going on in life, you got to redirect because that's not the way to go. So, you know, my environment that I placed myself in caused me to kind of slip back into that 3D action. That's okay. Part of being 5D is to notice where you are. So now, since we've accepted and since we've grown, since we've healed, we're ready to go fully back into the plant base. Okay. It's crazy how we haven't been taught that. Not only can you still have cheese and make cheese plant-based, but you can make it for half of the cost. And half of the cost, it's better for you. And it probably even tastes better. I know it tastes better nine times out of 10 if you know what you're doing in the kitchen. So um, I know I, 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 it's like I've lived another life that I haven't told you guys as far as like, you know, training and different things, music. We haven't touched that, you know, pillar yet, but we'll get to that. Um, but now, you know, for whatever reason, the alignment's right for us to go right into it. So I got to go in here. I got to run some errands. I just wanted to briefly touch on this topic. Are you guys feeling any type of way when it comes to your diet? Listen to your instinct. Nobody knows 
what's best for you other than you. So let's always keep that in mind. Listen to your instinct and know that you're never gonna lie to yourself. And the best decisions come from your heart, not from your head. So I'm gonna show you guys my journey just so if I can help somebody out there like, oh man, you know what? I didn't know that we can pair these things together and then we can have this that kinda is mimicking what I used to eat when I was in this 3D animal plant, animal thing, matrix, majigger. So um, anything else? I'm gonna go grocery shopping a little bit later and I'm gonna tune in with you guys and show you guys what I'm getting at the grocery store. I'm just making one stop today. I don't have time to go to Winco. I don't got time to go to these other places. So we're gonna hit up Sprouts. I'm gonna show you what I'm getting. I'm gonna show you why I'm getting it. And I'm gonna let you guys know anything else I got on my mind. So I appreciate each and every one of you guys for rocking with us, all my OG subscribers. I'm not gonna name names, but you know who you are. I appreciate all my new subscribers. Let's keep it coming. Let's keep it growing and flowing. And uh, any questions, any love you wanna share, leave it in the comments down below. Uh, hit this like button on this video. Like button's gonna be somewhere around down over here. Y'all know where that is. Subscribe to the video and to the uh, channel because we're growing this thing through the roof to the stars where it belongs. And last but not least, hit the notification bell so you know when I'm dropping these things, I want you to get them fresh off the, leave it in the comments down below. I love you guys and I'll see you soon. Forever out.